So one of the latest features from Ezoic is something called Humix. It's a video platform where you can use other people's videos on your website to make money. And in fact, I've done a video recently about it. You can see the thumbnail there. And I actually got some information incorrect. Yeah, that's right. I got something wrong. Uh, my wife says I do it all the time, apparently. But yeah, I reported some incorrect facts in that video. So I thought in today's video, I'll just quickly talk you through what Humix is and what I actually got wrong. And actually, Humix has been running on one of my websites now for 30 days. So I've actually got 30 days worth of data to show you. And we can have a look at the earnings and see what videos are making the money and what videos have been shown that other people have made on my website. So I thought it might be interesting to find out what this feature's all about. So first of all, what's it called? Well, it's called Humix. Don't ask me why, that's what it's called. And it's a, a new feature that you can find under the tab called Trailblazer. Now Trailblazer from Ezoic is uh, where all the new features will be kept. So once you have an Ezoic account or a Ezoic dashboard, you will see a little icon that appears on the top corner of your dashboard and you'll be able to click that and any new features will be under that tab. Now, Humix is one such new feature. So Humix is basically a video platform. It's a way to monetize pages on your website that you don't have any videos showing on and you can use other people's videos on those pages and you can earn some money from that. So how does it work? Well, take for instance, my age website case study, Gardenia Organic. I've made two or three videos for that um, website around a particular niche, a couple of topics like lawn care and growing vegetables. And I put those videos on the relevant pages. Now this website has over 800 articles on the website. And I only have a certain amount of lawn care articles and I only have a certain amount of vegetable, growing vegetable articles. So those videos are really only relevant and will only really maximize the income on those really relevant pages because if somebody's wanting to grow vegetables and there's a video about growing vegetables, they're more likely to watch it. So those videos are now appearing on these pages. Now, like I said, let's say that accounts for 100 articles on my website. That leaves 700 articles without any videos playing. Now, like I say, you could play those videos across all those articles, but they won't really earn a lot of money because like I said, they're not really topic relevant. So what can you do? Well, Humix is aware that you can use other people's videos. So what Humix will do at the switch of a button, and I will show you exactly what to do in a second, we'll jump on the computer. You can actually use other people's videos on those 700 pages that don't have any video content because you're leaving 700 possibilities out there on the table to earn money. You can actually earn and generate money from videos that you've not even produced on those pages. Now it's very simple, you simply click a button to say you allow other people's videos to appear on your website and you instantly start making money. Now it's a no brainer for me. There are a few questions that I had about this and we'll look at the dashboard in a moment and we'll see if some of my fears on this are relevant. And one of my fears was the type of videos that would appear on those pages. Because at the end of the day, if those videos are not relevant, I might as well have just put my own videos on those pages. But hopefully Ezoic's AI technology will sense what's the best type of content for that page. And it will look at things like tags and metadata and everything like that to hopefully find the right video from somebody else's website and put it onto yours. Now, it's kind of like a library of videos but it's videos that people with Ezoic accounts have uploaded to their dashboard. That's what it is. The difference is you're not grabbing a video from YouTube and embedding it into your website. You're uploading your video to your own Ezoic dashboard and that will be used on your website. And if you upload a video to your website and you click a button that says, I allow this video to be used on other people's website, that's where the magic happens because that's when you start earning that extra ad revenue. So just imagine you have, let's say, 30 or 40 videos uploaded to your Ezoic platform and those videos are being used across multiple websites all around the world, some big websites, some small websites. The ad revenue you can generate from that is 
enormous. I mean, the potential is fantastic. Imagine getting one of your videos on a website that gets a million page views a month. The ad revenue from that video from their website could be enormous. So that's how it works. What information did I get wrong then in the last video? Why did I withdraw that video from YouTube? Well, I thought that you would be able to choose the video that you want on those empty pages from a library or from somebody else's website. I thought I would be able to go to a library and say, okay, I like the look of that video and I want that video on that page. It's not how it works. Basically, it, you leave it to Ezoic's AI technology to just fill in those 700 pages that I've got that have not got a video, it will choose what video goes on what page. And that's where I got the information wrong. So it's been 30 days since I've left it running on one of my websites and I think we should look at some data. So we can jump on the computer now and we'll have a look at the analytics. There's a very detailed analytics section for Humix and you can see exactly which videos are making the money, where your videos are making money, where other people's videos are making money, and you can see the type of videos that's actually on there. So I think it's really, really interesting. Let's have a look at the computer now and we'll show you the dashboard. First of all, if you do want to use a Humix uh, feature, you do need an Ezoic account. I do have an affiliate link in the description if you are using Google AdSense at the moment. Why would you not put Ezoic on? You'll earn so much more money. And if you've not monetized your website, now's a great chance to do that. So click the Ezoic link in the description, sign up today. You don't need any criteria for joining, i.e. you don't need tens of thousands of page views. You can even get pretty new websites on Ezoic and you just need to follow the Google guidelines. If you get accepted by Google, then you will be able to display Ezoic ads and make plenty of display ad revenue. So let's jump onto the computer now and we'll take a look at my dashboard. So for those of you who don't know what the videos actually look like on a website, you can see here this is Gardenia Organic and you can see this is one of the articles we've written. And you can see over on the right hand corner, there's a video there playing. Now, again, this is not a video that I have made. This is somebody else's video that's playing on my website. But because I'm using Humix, I will still actually make money from this video. The owner of the video will make some money and I will also make some money. And if we just click it here, you can see this is the actual video reel here. Just a very simple video that somebody's made about a particular gardening item. And yeah, it's as easy as that. So let's have a look at the data and the numbers on my analytics through Ezoic. So here we are, this is one of the websites that I have in my portfolio and you can see the Trailblazer icon in the top right hand corner. Now if we click the Trailblazer, this is where you'll find any new features and as you can see here, Humix is actually on the Trailblazer tab. So all you would do is click access and you can see your dashboard here. So this is where it will show you the videos that you've made and uploaded to your Zoic dashboard. So there are two sections on this uh, dashboard here. You can see grow, which is sharing videos, and auto engage and earn. Now the difference between the two is that grow is basically your videos being shared on somebody else's website. So you're growing your income via sharing and allowing people to use these videos here on their website. So the auto engage and earn is basically where you are saying to Humix, I have some pages that don't have any videos, go out and find some great videos that match the content I've got and put those videos on those pages. And then you will start earning money and the owner of the video will start earning money as well. So they're the two settings you need there. There's obviously lots of things you can restrict. You can restrict where the videos are shown, whether they're displayed in the bottom of the post, the top of the post, etc. You can play around with that. Well, let's have a look at the analytics. I think that's what most people are interested in, the actual numbers. So here we are on the big data analytics inside Ezoic, and you can see in the bottom left hand corner, you can see Humix tab there. And if we click that, scroll up, you can see all the settings here. So total revenue from videos, how much you've earned from engage and earn. So that's other people's videos, how much you've made from their videos, what the content was, so what type of videos you're making that money from, and the pages where those videos was inserted. And then you have Grow Video Overview, that's your videos where how much money those have made on other people's websites, 
and again the content where the video was shown. Now I've set the date here from the 10th of May to the 10th of June because I ran it for a month and then I switched it off because I wanted to see like the engagement on the pages. So having videos on those pages, did it reduce the amount of time spent on page? Did people like it? Did they not like it? And I wanted a month's data to analyze against another month's data without videos and see what the difference is. So if we click the total video revenue, and you can see there we're in the 10th of May to 10th of June, you can see the total revenue there was $48.45. So let's have a look at some of the individual days. You can see here we've got some pretty decent days. So almost $3, again almost $3. There's a $4.26, $3.47. So there's some pretty good days there. And you can see here on June the 5th, my videos, and by the way, I only have like three or four really basic poor quality videos just to really test this out. Uh, and I earned nine cents that day from my three or four videos. But you can see here, engage and earn. That's other people's videos showing on my pages. Earned me four dollars and nine cents, which, you know, that's not too shabby. That's OK, that. And then my videos, which is the grow section, earned seven cents. So that's my videos shown on other people's websites. And you can see the next day, again, my own videos, hardly anything. Other people's videos on my website, $3.34, which I think is really good. Like I say, it's not cost me anything to put those on my website. And I'm earning money from the work that they've put into making these videos. And you can see there, that's from... 1861 page views so that's pretty good and there the one above it four dollars 26 that was from 2204 page views now if we have a look at some of the actual videos so you can see earn and engage videos so these are the days so everybody's video showing on my website you can see the individual days here and in a month it earned me 45 dollars and 80 cents now if we have a look at the content so this is a gardening website and you can see the type of videos that's been placed on my website. Now this is what I was really curious about. I want to make sure that they are relevant videos being shown on my website. And you can see here, 10 weirdest mushrooms of the world was the highest earner there at $1.46. And that's relevant. It's a gardening website. It's about growing mushrooms. That's absolutely fine. The next one here, 11 easy to grow herbs, very relevant. Tomato tips, relevant. Cactuses, daisy quotes, seaweed health benefits, maybe not too relevant, but you know, it's fine. That's not too bad. Um, leaf blowers, yep. Garden quotes. I mean, they're all relevant videos. So, and you can see if I increase that, you can see they're all pretty much relevant here. Garden benches, garden tools, hoverflies, fertilizers, they're all really relevant. So that's pretty good. There is one there that's a foreign language one, which I'm not too sure about. But to be honest, I haven't seen many of those. And it still earned 26 cents from 150 views. So uh, it still must be topic relevant, but you know, is in a foreign language. So I'm not sure if you can put that in the settings to not allow foreign language videos, but there you go. And if we have a look, you can see these are the pages where the videos are playing and where the videos are making most money. So you can see here, I've got one here, Aero Garden Lights Not Working. That is earning a decent amount. So that seems to be a very popular article to have a video on. Now, if we look at the video grow, so this is basically my videos on other people's websites. Again, remember, I've only got four videos so you know ideally you want 20 or 30 videos on here and you can see it only made one dollar 29 so my videos are not being selected by the ai to be played on other people's websites so it's because like I say i've only got four videos and then again if you look at the content you can see here my videos are here fruit and veg growing succulents lawn care and ride on lawnmowers and by far my lawn care guide is the most popular and then the video about ride on lawnmowers is also pretty popular the other two have not been shared at all for some reason so the ai has not chosen those videos to be placed on somebody else's website so maybe it's not found a relevant website or a relevant post 
to put my videos on and I'm cool with that. If the videos aren't relevant, I don't want them being put on other people's websites where they're not going to benefit really. So there you go. So you can see, you know, total revenue for a month, you know, almost $50. Um, which is pretty good and the vast majority of that is coming from other people's videos. So I have not made any effort whatsoever to make them videos. I literally just switched that video on to say that I want to switch on this part here, the engage and earn from Humix. So I hope you found that helpful. Give it a try. If you've not got your own, own videos, don't worry. Just switch and activate Humix on on your website and then click the engage and earn and you'll instantly see all your pages have other people's videos embedded in them and you'll start making some ad revenue money from their hard work. So thanks very much. Remember, if you want to join Ezoic, there is an affiliate link in the description. I will make a commission if you sign up to them. So I do appreciate that. I love the Ezoic platform and I particularly love this big analytics data. It's fantastic, some of the information you can get out of there. So thanks very much and I'll see you in the next video.